Well, the horses are on the track and printing the post for the fourth race. Invitational handicap pace of one mile, a purse of $9,000. Win place show exact to trifecta early pick three wagering. Races four, five, and six, there are no changes. Presenting the Invitational Handicap Pacers, the one is Powerhouse Sabra, owned by Runyon, Springer, and Cole. They're all of the Buckeyes State, trained by J. Doug Lowe with Jeff Fount. Number two is Norman Feeney, owned by Leslie Lane of Ostrander, Ohio, trained by Jim Pollock Jr. with a K-man, Kane Kaufman. Number three is Moe's Muffler Shop, owned by Reed Racing of Newark, Ohio, and Mona Almond of Fort Lauderdale, Florida, trained and driven by Dean Collins. Number four is Brad's Gold, owned by Derby's End Stable, Joe Descala Jr., Siad Mullinex, they're of Ohio and New York, trained by Virgil Morgan Jr., Brett Miller. The five is My Pal Mark, owned by Dolores Wilson of Columbus, Ohio, trained by Joe Wilson, Jim Daly. And number six is Super Gizmo, owned by Blatchford Presser and Presser. They're all of the Buckeye State, trained by Ron Potter, Dan Noble, Ian the Sulky. Oh, field swings to the back stretch. Field in motion. They're all fan pacing and firing away from the outside. There goes my pal Mark in between horses there. That is Brad's goal. Driving up from the rail, there is Powerhouse Sabra. Dropping in, racing in fourth. That is Super Gizmo. Along the inside in five is Norman Feeney in sixth and trailing the field. That is Moe's Muffler Shop. As they wheel around the first turn and over to the opening quarter and now clearing to the front end here. My pal Mark and Jim Daly has set this one down on the front end here. Brad's goal is going along in two as they race by the opening quarter in 26 and four fives. Marching on by the stands for the first time of the Invitational Handicap. On top of the field, my pal Mark leads him here by a length and a quarter. Rolling out of the wire with five eighths of a mile remaining. Brad's gold is stocking in second. Powerhouse Sabra along the inside is racing in third. First to flush and coming with a rush. Here comes Super Gizmo. First over the outside racing in fourth. Towing along Norman Feeney. Second over the outside in five and sixth and trailing the field. And a ground saving journey there is Moe's Muffler Shop. They went by the Half. They're halfway home in 56 and two fifths. Off the turn and setting sail down the backside and on top. My pal Mark leads it here by length and a quarter. But now grinding it out first over the outside, racing in two. That is Super Gizmo along the inside. Brad's Gold is watching over the doing leaders from third. Second over the outside, gapping the cover in fourth. That is Norman Feeney buried at the rail in five. Is Powerhouse Sabra sixth and trailing the field. Moe's Muffler Shop as they went by three quarters and one twenty-four and two fifths. They'll pace the final two and head for home and my pal Mark has got a recall thus far trying to make it a pull pulling a winning one here into the outside Super Gizmo is fading in second off the turn and less than an eighth of a mile to go and down the stretch they come with the invite my pal Mark is being set down for the drive Brad's gold is taking a shot at him from the pocket is coming to him and coming on but at the wire my pal Mark Holding sway, finishing second was the four. Brad's gold. It was very close for third. The tab of the mile, 152, four fives. My pal Mark and Jim Daly. For the fourth race, invitational handicap. Here's the five, my pal Mark. A six year old brown gelding by Tudor Scooter out of a Madam Board member mayor. She by chairman of the board. Is owned by Dolores Wilson of Columbus, Ohio. Trained by Joe Wilson. Nicely handled here this evening by winning driver Jim Daly. The five, my pal Mark, takes the invitational handicap and 152 four fives. Five four exact returns, $10 even. Five four six try, $21 even.